that's why this show has totally evolved into conversations about fighting. That's a much different perspective than I think like most Americans have. I think most Americans, uh, th although there, there's a small percentage that uh, have similar stories to you. But have you, have you talked to my shrink? Because like we're talking about my insecurities right now. I am afraid to be homeless, like big time. Well, okay, this, <laughs> this is my point. Uh, as far as a motivator for like later on down the road, um, success in business, it's it's a it's a it requires a certain drive, it, and that's why this show has totally evolved into conversations about fighting. Um, you know, my experience training MMA with guys that go in, you know, professionals and uh, high-level amateurs, and they they put you in the fucking cage and they shut the door behind you, and you have to claw your fucking way out of there. There's no backup. Like your coaches are ringside. There's nothing they can do for you. You're the one that gets knocked out. You're the one that gets your arm snapped. You're the one that gets choked unconscious. So like you're responsible and 100% accountable for like all of your success and all of your failures. And I think, I don't think, I know um, this country in particular has created this bubble, this, this false reality for so many people that want to be entrepreneurs and like, business owners and self-employed that it, they don't understand. They don't have that. Like, I don't want to be homeless. So this has to fucking succeed.